What is happening? Where am I? What is this fantasy? I've never been more scared in my life. But it's not like I can tell anyone. This is real life. Is it normal? For the time being, anyway. China. What of this place concerns me? Why am I here? The food? Am I just some gluttonous fool? If that is my sole purpose? To indulge? To order too much? To waste? No. There must be more to why I'm here. Did God bring me here? To evangelize? Is that my calling? I followed the Olympics quite closely almost 10 years ago here. My presenters back home would go on and on about the smog and how it affects our athletes. But I can tell you, it's not that bad. There's been beautiful clear days here. But I still can't help but feel uneasy. There's lots of discussion about whether this revamp of the city was just a facade to the world, a showcase of everything China wasn't, or what they want you to think it is. There are 25 million people living in this city. That's Australia's entire population in Beijing. Then again, it's a measly number compared to the billion other people here in this country. China is one of North Korea's closest allies. Pyongyang is literally less than a couple hours away by air. Seems pretty accessible, doesn't it? But really it isn't. It's perhaps the most inaccessible place on Earth. It'd probably be easier for me to climb Everest than enter North Korea, considering the pole is almost equidistant on China's other side. So it must be a really shitty place. So I've heard. What about this dump? I'm not here to merely scratch the surface. This nation has not gone without evil. As much as they try to suppress the truth of the past, it's there. How deep will I dig? Will I find anything? There's just too much simplicity around me. What are they hiding? Will I get in trouble for my curiosity? Am I being watched? Will I be imprisoned or killed? Will I find too much? There has to be more to my being here. Why do I feel like I must make meaning of this place? It's literally a billion times more important than my own existence. And yet, I'm here. This place has a history. It has human beings who have lived, who have suffered, who have loved. This place is good.
this city has transformed. Once upon a time, these hutongs were familiar. Fathers would go up to work, traveling along the Tsomen path. Children would meet and go to school together by the same path. Those who did not go to school would gather and play in the safety of the hutong. Their mothers were not far away. They would cook for the children and the passing neighbors, and await their husbands with supper. The elders would play their chess, drink tea, and smoke all day. Life in the hutong was simple and beautiful. How and why did we destroy the old city? Dadubai 大兵一道牲口粮食一扫光我们要做一个更深的地方，但我试图了解这个城市，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新了解它，我们要重新
you pole a tiny boat toward where the green is even more green to collect a load of stars as songs rise in the gleaming stellar light but tonight my voice fails me silence is the best tune of farewell even crickets are still for me and still is Beijing tonight silently I am going as silently as I came I shake my sleeves not to bring away a patch of cloud. Mm -hmm.